So let's just talk about Autodesk subscriptions just in general. All right, so there's, because there's three types of subscription and I wanna make sure it's really clear to you. So most of you out there have probably purchased the building design suite, the AutoCAD design suite, or the infrastructure suite. No, somewhere, somewhere there you've purchased one of the suites. And you probably also, because you're with Microsoft, I'm sure that they would encourage you strongly to uh, have maintenance subscription. So like every year you pay a fee, and then when the next release of the software comes out, you get it automatically, right? Um, so that's one type of subscription. In fact, let's just go ahead and go to that page so you can see the benefits there while we're talking about it. Very flexible with licensing. You know, if you have a 10-person license and you have 15 people, as long as they're not using it at the same time, you can probably kind of get away with the licensing aspect. And there's some great technical support that we offer up if you have a maintenance subscription. And of course, you do get more Autodesk use of cloud benefits, right? As I mentioned to you before. So that's a maintenance subscription. And most of you probably have that. Most of you have probably done that. It's easy to budget for and you know, makes a lot of sense. Um, but we're, we're introducing to you something um, that's fairly new called desktop subscription, which is a pay as you go. So let's say you have a project coming on and you need, I'll just say you need 10 AutoCAD, just as an example. You can actually just pay as you go. <laughs> you can say, I want uh, three months worth of these 10 AutoCAD fees. Or, and then you can maybe add three more if it turns out that's not enough. Or you can just say, I just want them all for a year. But the nice thing about this is it's a very low cost of entry. You're not buying the whole product. And you certainly don't want to buy the whole product if you're only going to be using these seeds of AutoCAD for a limited amount of time, right? The same would be true of the building design suite. You know, I, I need three more building design suites, but I only need them for six months. All of this is available to you at a much lower cost than actually purchasing it. And it's also great because another big positive is that you can usually charge this back to the building owner, right, or whoever is running the project because it's very obvious that you're only using the software for the project. Um, that's another, it's, it's much more easy, much more billable, which is always nice. Um, and like I said, you can scale up or scale down, scale down. You don't have a lot of risk. Not a lot of money is involved. And that might be the perfect answer for you. So that's a desktop subscription. And then last but not least, some of the cloud items that I showed you require a subscription, and like, like field and glue. So that, on a, in that situation, is on a per project basis. But uh, that's just another example of a subscription that you would sign up for. So you have access to those, server, that, those services whenever you need them. And the good news is that Microsoft, who, yay, partner of the year, congratulations, that is not easy to get. Very, very excited. I'm not surprised. They're amazing. But I can assure you, if you have any questions about this, if it wasn't clear and you're not exactly sure what the right answer is for you, um, they're going to help you. They're going to help you out, and they're going to lead you in the right direction. That's why they're partner of the year, because they're trusty. You can trust them. They do a great job. They're brilliant. 